Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ashley. Thank you so much for tuning in. Today's video is going to be about a Q&A, a simple Q&A. So I have a bunch of um, questions that I received from my previous video that I did a giveaway. Um, and yeah, I told a lot of people to please leave me a comment with questions that they wanted me to answer and they did. So I will be answering a few of their questions and yeah. I hope you guys enjoy and please I am wearing this like robe because I'm sitting here chatting with you and I'm not gonna uh, wear something nice. Right? Does that make sense? Is, that, is it okay with you? Is it okay with you? Is it okay with you? We good? We Gucci? So let's get started. My first question says, how long you think you'll be on YouTube for? From Serena B. Um, I asked something so funny. I actually started doing YouTube when I was maybe 17, 18, I think. Um, so about quite some time. Um, I met a few of the YouTubers as well when I started doing all this. I was really, really into it. Um, and just things started it's it's crazy how like you just stopped my computer broke and then i just like forgot about youtube and stopped making videos until like now that i'm kind of like starting again um it's just life gets in the way and it maybe if you guys want to know maybe stories of these youtubers i met i met mac barbie which is not mac barbie now she's like bethany life i think um, I met Alex Lucy, I've met Megan Hart's makeup, but hopefully I will stick around this time. You know, school's hard, so yeah, thank you for asking. So next question, um, favorite makeup product from Jennifer Palace. Mm, hi Jennifer. So my favorite makeup product will be, I think, bronzer, just because I I think bronzer or concealer can I like I hear bronzer concealer bronzer I'm very pale and I think that it kind of helps me I know on camera I put so much tons of stuff to try to look a little alive but usually I'm very like pale especially throughout this the winter so bronzer will give keep, keep me in check and my and my contour in check and then just concealer, I can use it as mimic it for a foundation. And yeah, thank you for asking that question. Yeah. Addy, I'm probably but butchering and I'm so sorry. Are you dating anyone? I am dating someone. Um, I do live with my significant other. And yeah, thank you for asking. Do you like Sephora or Ulta better? Personally, I like Ulta. How about you? Rowan Hobson. Hi, Rowan. But I think I like Sephora, I think. Just because I've never so much makeup and I've never been in an Ulta. But I've maybe been there like once. And that's just being truth with you guys. So I would say definitely Sephora. Next question. What's your Insta handle? From Harsha. Raj Put. Hi Harsha, I'm so sorry if I'm butchering your username. Um, I do apologize to anyone that I butcher your name. Um, but I do not have one currently. I will be making one for my YouTube channel soon and I'm planning a giveaway so stay tuned for that. The next question is What's your worst makeup experience? So I don't know. Well, I could tell you about an experience. Once I went to IMATS, and it was my first IMATS. There were so many YouTubers. I think even like Gigi Gorgeous was there. Um, and I went with one of my good friends, and I got my makeup done there. Girl. Girl. <laughs> I left, and I was like, my face. What? Why, is, why do my eyebrows look like this? I don't know it was just not good so I guess that qualifies as a makeup and experience 
I don't know. But yeah, thank you for your lovely question. So next question, I'm just scrolling. Uh, it's Christina Alberti. Hi, Christina. Um, Q&A, favorite high-end and drugstore lashes? So I do not own any mascara. I think I probably am lying. I own like two. And that's because I get my eyelashes done. I have very fine like eyelashes so they all fall out and it's just like not nice not nice so I get them done professionally and yeah so I don't need to get put on mascara but yeah thank you for your question okay next question uh you should do let me see which bag replica has been your favorite purchase from I offer by far Kendra Taylor hi Kendra so thank you so much for your question and I think I've only purchased like two things from iOffer and if you don't know about iOffer I think they shut down like all the counterfeit because it's counterfeit um, items and but based on your question I would say the best one was this Never, the Neverfull bag I bought the the it was twenty five dollars Neverfull and it taught me that I or showed me that I really really liked that bag so I ended up purchasing the real authentic item so I think that was the best one um, in my opinion if you guys have ever seen that video I I will leave it down below um, it was twenty five dollars and so like I was saying I think that that was the best. I'll leave the video down below if you guys want to check it out. It was pretty funny to watch because it's one of my first videos. There's no light. There's like, I'm like, I had no editing experience. It was just disaster 101. But it was pretty funny and I would, you know, it was just funny. But that, I think that was the best video I've had. Sanjana Moore. You could do a sit down reaction videos of Games of Thrones. So, hi, um, Sanjana. Um, I do not watch Games of Thrones. I'm so sorry. And this is so, like, maybe it's not funny, but it is funny to me. I do not know. No, I know so many people that watch it, and I just don't. Even um, George watches it, and he's always like, and I'm like laughing about it because it's so funny. He always tells me, "Come watch it with me," when it was like on, and I'm like, "No, I can't, and I just can't." But thank you for asking that question. My next question is from Irene Flores. Irene Flores says, "Fenty, hi, Irene." Um, Fenty or Marc Jacobs? Ooh, that's a hard one. So I do have a lot of Fenty and Marc Jacobs products. So, I don't know. I think I would go with Marc Jacobs just because I do a I use a lot of their foundations, of his foundations, so I think I would use that. I would say that. But great video, caught me off guard right there. Also, these questions I haven't seen before. I'm just like going through and picking a few um what is your favorite food from alia putin putinim hi alia i'm so sorry <laughs> i'm so sorry if i'm pronouncing all these names wrong but my favorite food is thai food i literally have so many questions here guys look at that so many questions Ugh. And I'm really trying to pick like the good ones just for you guys to get to know me a little bit. And Mariana, okay. Oh, what a pretty picture she has. Um, hi there. So I think this one says, what is one thing you can't live without? One thing? Uh, well, I could live without a lot of things, but um, I think my family is just such a blessing to me and my significant other is such great support and without him, I don't know what I, I would do and he just keeps me grounded and yeah I think he's like him and my family are the one thing I can't live without thank you for that thing got me almost emotional okay next question <laughs> oh my god 
Hopefully this video is not like 3,000 hours. Makeup collection video. I will do one. Do you guys want a makeup collection? Give this video a like if you really, really want a makeup collection. And I will show you all of the that's in there. At what age did you get your first boyfriend? Whoa. <laughs> um. I don't know. Like maybe 13. 13, I would say. I know. But trust me, we didn't do like. It was just like. Maybe I will like hug him. That's it. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> okay. How old am I? Kendra again. Hi, Kendra again. <laughs> um, how old are you? I am 28. This is the last one I will do. And if you guys really do enjoy this video, please don't forget to give this video a like. If you guys want to make up in a room tour, maybe, please give this video a like. So this is the last question I will do. And it's from It's Just Me. Um, hi, It's Just Me. Um, what inspired you to become a YouTuber? So, when I was younger, I did not, and I still don't have a lot of friends. Um, I have very count, I can count like in my hands. That's how many friends I have. I, and I actually trust, because you, you can have many acquaintances. But I just did not have that. Um, so that kind of like made me want to do YouTube. Like, look at videos, play with makeup, and then... I realized how many people actually like watching these videos just like me and I just decided I was like what the heck I'll do it and yeah and then that's how my journey started and then I stopped life got in the way and then now I'm back grinding and doing it and doing what I love and it's and it's just something like I said my my significant other helped me a lot through this to to come back and actually do what I like he said, if you, if you like this, why don't you do it? Why, who, who's stopping you? Get your camera and do it, right? And that's what I, I did, and I'm so blessed. And yeah, thank you so much for watching, everyone. And I think that'll be it for today. Thank you so much for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. It's free. <laughs> so yeah, thank you, and I hope everyone has a blessed day. And don't forget, you could do it as well. Anyone can do it. It's free. And yeah, you just need to have a little faith in yourself. So, bye guys.